I don't know about you, but I love a low maintenance unit that's glueless and allows me to get on my life. Keep watching and I'm gonna give you all the deets. Okay, y'all, so first I'm gonna show all the things you'll receive in your package. Of course, there's the unit. And as you guys can see, this unit does come pre-plucked, the knots are bleached, and this is a five by five lace. And of course, it is glueless, so it comes with an adjustable elastic band and along with the other goodies I'm showing on the screen. Now, this is a curly unit, so you guys already know to define all my curly units, I do a co-wash first, and I love to trim the ends. Now, if you want it layered, you could trim it layered. I prefer to just trim mine straight across. This is going to help your ends be more defined once you comb it through. And all you have to do is take some conditioner water in a bottle, spritz the hair, and comb it with a brush, and you're good to go. Okay, so this is the unit now that is dried. Oh, the curls look really nice. Let's go ahead and try this unit on. Okay, giving you guys a closer look at the hairline. I am gonna go on top of this using my hot comb really quickly, just because I prefer for my curly units to be flat on top and to gradually go into the curl. If you don't like your units to be flat on top, of course you can skip this step. And although I don't typically do baby hairs, I do prefer to do them when I have a curly unit. So I'm just cutting off some slight, slight, slight baby hairs. And I'm straightening the hairline with my hot comb to get everything nice and laid. I love to use a little small curling iron to curl up my baby hairs. And I'm gonna lay it down using my baby hair brush. Real simple. Now, I know some of you guys may say, okay, this is a low maintenance, but you're doing work. This is something that you only have to do one time and one time only when you first get your unit. After that, this unit is going to be something that you literally could just throw on. And to get this lace to blend more with my complexion, I'm going to use my mousse tint. And I'm gonna tie it down with this elastic band that this wig came with, just for about five minutes to get everything to mesh well together. Because I am in a rush, I did use the end of my blow dryer to diffuse this out and dry it. Of course, you can also just air dry the unit if you prefer. And I'll just let you see the difference between the unit that is diffused as opposed to the one I haven't dried with the diffuser yet. And this unit install was so simple. Your girl started dancing. I love when my life is easy. You guys know I wear wigs for convenience and nothing more. So I'm just teasing this hair out a little bit just to get it a little bit more poofy because I do prefer my unit to be a little bit more big. Now, one thing I will tell you guys is don't use, don't do like I did and use this hot comb on a wet unit. As you can see the steam, it was burning my fingers and my forehead. After I finished doing that, all I had to do was spritz it with a little bit of my gloss wait before i finish let's go ahead and clean up that part in space now you guys know i like to use my root touch up and i put it on a little uh, what a spoolie and just comb it along the roots of the hair just to get the part nice and neat and bada boom bada bang i'm done okay doll so this is what this unit is looking like i absolutely love the curl pattern and as i mentioned this unit is from recool hair this is my first time collaborating with them this is their deep curly five by five unit now the original length they sent me was 16 inches as you guys saw i already chopped it up 
Um, and I did cut a little bit more than I cut in the beginning because it's just kind of like when you start manipulating curly hair, as you know, it shrinks, right? So you'll have like little pieces come out here. So I just been snipping, snipping. I've cut at minimum two inches, maybe even four inches. Cause as you guys know, this is curly hair, so it shrinks. But if you pull it, it will elongate again. So I always like to cut my curly units just because I feel like, I don't know, I just feel like they look better than just leaving it in the original state it comes in. I didn't used to do that, but I've noticed that since I've done it, I really have been enjoying the units a lot better. Along with my conditioning water, this with my Demon brush is a win-win combination. It has made manipulating the curly unit so much easier for me. I absolutely love it. Now, as far as the unit's concerned, I did co-wash the unit and I didn't really get much shedding or tangling from this unit for that matter, which is really impressive because a lot of curly units tend to shed more than the typical straight or wavy units. So that is a good sign. And of course, I absolutely love this curl pattern. That's one of the reasons I wanted to collaborate because I've seen a couple of videos with this unit and they all look good. So rest assured, they got them one with this one. And this is a middle part, and I am not mad at this middle part. Now you guys know I do not like middle parts, but there are some units that just kind of flows. And I like to think that this is one of them, but I don't know, you guys let me know what y'all think. I'm gonna stand up so you guys can get a closer look to see what it looks like. Now I like big hair, so I think I am gonna fluff this up a little bit more when I'm finished, just to get it a little bit bigger. But of course, wear your unit however you see fit. And as you guys saw, this unit is glueless. All I added was my little tinted mousse. And of course, it's still glueless. So that's pretty much all I got for you guys. I don't know if they have a coupon code, but if they do, I'm gonna be sure to put that across the screen. I'll also include in the description box down below. But before we get out of here, y'all know I'm gonna need y'all help naming this beauty. What do you think we should call her? Go ahead and leave your name suggestion in the comment section down below. And I did pick a name for the unit I reviewed in my last video. The new name as well as the person who submitted the name will be listed across the screen. So dolls, if you found this video helpful, go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. And if you're not already part of the Faithful Fam, hit that subscribe button and join the family. I love to have you. And while you're at it, why don't you check out this video? You might enjoy it as well. As always in part and until next time, you guys stay blessed. And if it be God's will, I'll see you in my next video. Take care now.